Hi everyone, my name is Karen and this is Chosen and Precious Farm. In today's video, we are finally going to get started on doing the trim around the door and the trim around some of the windows here in the living room, kitchen, bathrooms. Uh, maybe we'll even get to the trims in our be master bedroom. So let's check it out. All right, this is what the framing looked like first. I don't know why, but whoever had this place did not bother to frame it or do the trim around. So it's very open. So we're gonna seal the whole thing. We already put one side. So that's what we're going for. 75 una cora. Cuarenta, cuarenta, cuarenta. All right, we're putting silicone on the edges to seal off the trim. It's looking good, it's looking really perfect. We were not exactly sure how we wanted to do these windows, so we tried one out off camera. All right, so here is the framing around the window, or the trim around the window, and the um, blinds that we decided to go with. So we do, we liked the like recessed window sill with the blinds that are inside the window look. So we tried to do that here to have minimal light coming in. 
So if I open this blind, you can see that we did it to the same exact measurement of the blind. We put the trim around the window. Then when you lower the blinds, we did go with the blackout blinds. It has that look. We're so happy about this right now because it doesn't even look like a window from a mobile home. It just looks like a normal house window. Perfect. This is the blinds we're using. The Allen and Roth um, blackout blinds. This is the size. And we um, chose it in the color white. We got these for $40.98 at Lowe's. Oh my gosh, they won't stop. The babies! It's okay, babies. It's okay. The reason we got these, we really love the blackout blinds from Ikea, which is the ones that we ended up putting in our kitchen, which are these ones. But these ones were way more expensive, like $20 each more, even for the size 30. And they, the way they attach like this um, comes out from the wall too much. You can see it comes out from the wall a little bit too much. So we wouldn't be able to do the recessed window look like we did in the living room with these ones. But, oh gosh, don't look at the mess. But it's pretty much the same thing. The ones from Lowe's look almost exactly the same. And they cost me $20 less. To get that recessed look that I just showed you in the other windows, we decided to put the blinds first, get them exactly where we wanted them. And to after we put the blinds, then do the trim around the windows. So we are done putting the trim around the windows and done putting the blinds and this is what it's looking like. Ta -da! Ta -da! So we had never put the blind on the window in the kitchen but we 
had already done the trim because we did the trim when we did the backsplash. So we can't do it a recessed way here since we had already put the trim, but we'll do it a normal way. Once again, thank you for watching. If you'd like to see more of us, there are some videos here you can click. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so that you are notified whenever we upload our next video. God bless!